Hello and welcome to the product presentation of Geom Caliper, an integrated, automated and easy to use thickness checking software for 3D CAD models. We will quickly move on to the technical presentation of Geom Caliper. Here we can see a component in CATIA V5 environment. We can simply click the Geom Caliper icon and select the component. This component will be imported into Geom Caliper for advanced analysis. We will start with the main functionality of Geom Caliper called Thickness Checker. In Thickness Checker we have two methods. One is Ray method which is used for locating the minimum wall thickness regions and Sphere method which is used for locating the maximum wall thickness regions. A color display of the component along with the color band and the scale will be available for analysis. We can move the mouse to various locations in the component. We can do some clip art sectioning, caps lock and use similar functionalities to diagnose the area better. The scale and the color band are also editable. change the color and the component model. Now we'll move on to the next critical functionality of Geom Caliper called Locate Critical Regions. Here we can find out the wall thicknesses in the range of less than, greater than, between or outside range thicknesses. We'll try to find out the wall thicknesses less than 3 mm. We'll have a list of the regions here. As soon as we click any of these regions, a sectioned view of that particular region will be available. Here the wall thickness is approximately 1 mm. And similarly we can find out the areas which are greater than 62 mm wall thickness. Now we will move on to the next critical functionality of Geom Caliper, 2D thicknesses at section. Here we can find out the wall thicknesses at any section like X, Y, Z or any virtual plane. We will start with the ray method here. This analysis tells us the minimum distance between the two faces as it is shown here. We can also alter the planes. And say calculate again. Similar color band display of sections will be available. We'll move on to the 3D thickness at section. We can select any virtual planes like we'll select three point plane now and say calculate here the blue areas represents the maximum wall thickness just go and click there and the wall thicknesses will be shown we come to the end of the presentation please visit our website and for any other queries please write to gc.marketing at geometricglobal.com thank you very much